Her record, 13 wins, only three losses. She is the current WIBF and WIBA Women's Heavyweight Champion. Arthur Salazar brings a large crowd. A lot of people love to watch her fight. No touch of the gloves. Just In general, Martin's not just important, she's a legend in the sport, and she's been around a long time, and she's opened the doors for the heavyweight division. And not only has she brought it back to life, but she's been a role model and a mentor to all these young girls who, um, especially Latinos, who um, want to go to school, want to accomplish something, because she has a college degree. So she just isn't a boxer, she's got a college degree, and she is a great role model in every other way. Yeah, and you know what? See? That's what you got to do when you're in there. She pushes me really hard because everybody knows, you know, I'm her niece. I got to be good, and her pushing me helps me in life as well. In my career, most sometimes I have to pay the other fighters so they can come over here. She goes, I'll fight Martha for $10,000. I said, we don't have $10,000. Here's 2500 No, yeah. we can't take the fight. Because they want so much money, you know? Yeah. And so sometimes I got to lose, but I love the sport. <laughs> Where's my title? Where's the belt? Somebody stole, uh, somebody stole it already? Oh my god, no way! We had to fight for this one and I had to win this one. Got invited to the WBC Convention Center in Vegas with all the champions. It was fun, we met a lot of people, a lot of the champions, Mayweather, you know, Oscar de la Hoya. Oh, and Layla Ali, we had to, yeah, we took pictures with her. It was like a keep it in a candy shop, like, where, where I go, which one, where I go? It gives me chills just talking about it, man. We're really proud of her, you know what I mean? Uh, when uh, she won her world title, I cried. And I cried a lot, man. I did cry when I won the belt. Happy I got to see that and share that moment with her. I'm glad she's my trainer, you know? I was in high school, I got jumped by three Samoan girls, not disrespect to the Samoan people. I love you guys, you know, but... <laughs> At this occasion, you know, I, I got jumped by three of them and just got my ass beaten, and so I was just like, uh... The, the wild swinging right hand that did not land, but nice right uppercut lands from Vonda, but then she takes... And so from there, I was watching a TV show uh, kickboxing fights, and then um, this girl kicked this girl in the head and knocked her out, and I was like, oh, I gotta do that, I gotta go and see what's up with this kickboxing thing. When we first started fighting together, uh, we were kickboxers. Um, I'd always get a fight because I fought at 108, and a lot of times she would show up to the weigh-ins, the person would show up to the weigh-ins, and then wouldn't, wouldn't show up to fight. I'd be scared too. Hey, Martha! Yeah. Martha Salazar is just continually stalking Vonda Ward, not letting Von Der Ward get comfortable with that jab. <laughs> just getting in there one on one and just getting all your stress out and not getting in trouble when you fight, you know? <laughs> so that's the best part.